So this is a 60 watts soldering iron. In the package, it usually comes with a stand that you can easily set up. And the stand helps you in placing the soldering iron while it's hot so that you don't end up burning your surface or any other items that are within your workshop. So I did exactly that. And you go ahead and connect it to the power and put it on the on switch. And always remember to place your soldering iron on the stand. So once you've done that, then now to your workstation, what are you joining? You're going to use a solder wire and you're also going to need flux, welding flux, if your solder wire does not have the flux. And then go ahead and prepare the wire or item that you want to fuse together. And then you're going to soften the motherboard just to prepare it and it if it does not have enough solder, you're going to add more solder. Go ahead and apply the flux onto the material that you want to weld. In this case, I'm using a very hard uh, welding flex. So I need to use some heat just to soften it. Go ahead and apply some solder onto your rod and then transfer that to the wire as shown. And then you're going to soften the surface of the PC, PC board and then you're going to attach the wire. And if the solder is not enough, then you're going to go ahead and add more solder so that it has a strong fixture. Then, of course, just test it if it's strong enough so that it doesn't come off. That's good. And then we're going to give it another try. Remember, I'm using a very hard uh, flux. So I have been using some heat just to soften it so that I can cover the wire. And then go ahead and put some solder onto the tip of the soldering iron then go ahead and coat it coat the wire with the with the solder and then we're going to give it another second try start by softening the surface that you want to attach the wire to her. and then place the wire and run your soldering iron on top and that was really easy Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.